Hey guys, what is up? This is Sahil Wurtz and uh, in this video I'm going to tell you uh, Wait, just let me just cut this Yeah, so in this video I'm going to tell you that if your device is not getting connected See, I have uh, already connected it with the USB But nothing is happening over here in the SP flash tool So, uh, if this is the case, uh, that means you have not uh, installed the uh, MTK USB preloader uh, drivers uh, So we are going to install that drivers so before that you need to disable uh, driver signature enforcement first uh, uh, I've already made one uh, tutorial regarding that you can check out in the i button which you will see on the top right corner of your screen okay so uh, now we are going to install it I'll uh, provide you the file in the description box you can download it from there uh, so this is the type of file I'll show you so this is the file windows 10 mtk vcom usb preloaded uh, drivers okay and after uh, extracting it it will become like this okay these two files you will get so we are going to install it so for that first go to device manager uh, by right clicking on the start menu okay so here's the device manager which will look like this then go to action click on add, uh, add legacy drivers wait let me just stop this first yeah uh, then click on next click on install the hardware driver manually advance next have disk Click on browse and search where's the driver. So here's the driver. I'll select x64. Click OK. Click on uh, MediaTek USB VCOM port. Preloader USB VCOM port. Uh, click next. And it will start stalling the driver. So here you can see the software device is now installed but may or may not work prefer, uh, perfectly. So click on finish and i hope your problem will be solved after doing this okay so i uh, if you find this tutorial helpful do like this uh, video so thank you guys for watching this video i'll meet you in the next video till then goodbye